What's good YouTube fam, I'm still back with another video and if you're new to this channel make sure you smash the sub button and join the family. Also make sure you follow me on all social media at Omnitilla. Um, all the links are in the description below and if I decide to follow uh, post this on Facebook make sure you sub to my YouTube channel's page. You know what I'm saying? At Omnitilla, um, it's all the same, you spell it the same way. But look, you see the title of the video so I'm not going to waste too much time. We're going to get straight into this. We're going to see what's really going on. So first of all, somebody posted, I don't know, somebody it says some tweets were hidden by blah, blah, whatever. So it says a black woman is going to you see the word, you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying this on here because they like to but whatever. For 15 years on holding a peaceful for holding a peaceful protest. Come on guys, let's talk about it, please. Hashtag free Tiana. Right? Tiana, Tiana, let me know how y'all pronounce it in the comments section below. I don't want to say nobody name wrong. You feel me? But um They said, How are y'all gonna give her 15 years just for having a peaceful protest? Right? And gives Brock Turner six months. And only have him serve three. This just system is America is so messed up. That's what somebody said. Um, literally, you see it on the screen. So I want to know y'all opinions so far. Just by hearing this information. What do you think? But let's continue. Alright. You see this picture, SLO, they're pointing out other flaws in the system, right? Whenever they speak on this, they're pointing out other flaws in the system. So, here we go. These are the charges, right? Well, I don't know if it's specifically, but this is what somebody said. She's face, she is facing 50 years and five felony charges. Five now. You know, five charges for organizing a peaceful protest. Wow. For all you Constitution, I'm just reading it like, you know, <laughs> Constitution defenders to step the F up. So they say y'all need to step up. So apparently, here we go. I guess this is the rally that she held. Support, support our young leaders. Or this just might be like a petition for her. But either or, um, this is the the rally she held. You see people out there. So on Tuesday, July twenty first, Tiana. I don't know how to pronounce your last name, so I'm not going to try to slander it, you know. We'll come back to that in a minute. Tiana was arrested by Slow PD about 8 p.m. near Mitchell Park as other demonstrated were leading the park. Okay, so like, like we just, we already know this, you know, they was arrested. We didn't know where it was, so... I guess that's important. Um, at about 8 p.m. around Highway 101. Um, let's see. So they're saying that people are creating a false narrative around the, as they're saying that they're promoting violence. Tiana and other protest leaders have led numerous, Not this is not their first rodeo. They've led numerous peaceful protests over the past several months. It's clear that SLO County District Attorney and SLO PD are using the arrest of Tiana as a political statement to try and supply, you know, to try basically slow them down, you know, and make a statement. You know, but it's against their first amendment right as written on this screen right here. That's what they mean by suppress. You know. Um, it's crazy. 
Tiana's racial charges were unjust. Our community should come together to support her and her family, protect your young Black Lives Movement leader um, and protest and demand that the district attorney or any charges against Tiana, you know, basically get dropped. So, let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section below. Do you feel like it's right what they're doing? Did they make the right decision by arresting her? Um, or do you feel like, you know, it was a peaceful protest and as long as she does it peacefully, there should be no problems? Um, or do you feel like it's just, it's all a show or it's all a distraction? People always have these conspiracies. I want to hear what you think about everything in the comment section below.